our economy is. Um, you shouldn't have to travel to another state to um, have a procedure on your body. I kind of like his, his morals. I literally don't want to throw away my vote. Can you be a little bit more specific? Um. While we were on campus today, we noticed there's a lot of misconceptions about our political candidates' policies. Here's what students have to say. That Project like, 2025 thing, and I've mouthed into it. That junk is low-key insane, but a lot of it, from from what I've been told, is mostly like people running or like Republicans around Trump, but not Trump himself. But like if those if those were Trump policies, like in actuality. Like, that's low-key insane. That's some yeah. nut job type stuff. Do you know who created Project 2025? Low-key, I do not. I'm going to keep it a book. Okay, okay. it was a Republican think tank. Oh, that sounds and, about right. Yeah, um, that definitely that checks out. <laughs> the, the Trump campaign does not support it. Okay. Yeah, I know yeah, okay. that. I did know that. I really hear people saying it's like a civic duty and something that you should do as a citizen. But um, the state where our, I feel like our country is at right now, I really don't think that there's going to be anything that progresses us forward. I think that's a big misconception is that people's votes don't matter, but it really does. And you shouldn't, if you complain about change, if you want things to change, you should probably vote on the things to change. However, what we found to be more prevalent is that many students don't know who they're going to be voting for in November. Who are you voting for in the upcoming election? Um, usually I just go with my parents because I don't really know anything about politics, so my parents are voting for Trump. I'm not really sure. I'd like to do some more research before I could actually decide. It's a big choice for me because I'm selecting my next boss. To me, I kind of like having, you know, reduced prices on food and gas. Abortion laws are a big thing for me. I know it's a big thing for a lot of people. Um, I think free access to healthcare is also probably something that needs to be looked at. On immigration, I think our borders should be more open. Looking at it as a younger uh, individual, I have been a waitress for three plus four years. Um, so no taxes on tips would be great. 